Smart Play Network is a national organisation which supports a range of play providers, uh, from toy libraries right through to play ranger services. Uh, we offer consultancy, training, guidance sheets, all sorts of different advice and support right from set up through to sustaining a project. We know that uh, regular, frequent and progressive experiences of outdoor learning and play, uh, which are of a high quality, are really influential both in terms of uh, children and young people's motivation and engagement in their learning, uh, their approach to their learning in terms of it being more open-ended and their ability to be quite resilient uh, about challenges that they face in their learning and that there is a direct relationship between the kind of adventures and the play uh, and the experiences that they have in the outdoors and the way that they do approach their learning in an indoor kind of more formal classroom context. So exploring what high quality outdoor learning and play means through this project has actually been really important to us in terms of some of the things that we know are essentials for the healthy growth and development and learning and dispositions toward learning uh, that we want to develop in our children and young people, particularly with regard to the full capacities of Curriculum for Excellence. And what we're trying to establish here is a group of um, playground assistants who see the value in play and how it fits in with um, the entirety of a child's education throughout the school experience. We've taken the lead on the project and facilitated it, um, so just arranging the days and bringing to bit together the co collaboration um, and beyond that our trainers have got involved in, in training the PSAs alongside Peak and Aberdeen Play Forum uh, to hopefully deliver a comprehensive package that will increase their confidence and give them the knowledge and skills that they can take back to their schools and enforce play. I think that Education Scotland have been very forward thinking about the role of play in schools and it's been um, heartening for us to find out that, that you know the people who are, are such a lead organisation in this area are taking us seriously and seeing play as something that is vital to a child's education and that's been a very positive experience for us. Um, one of the things that we've been really trying to take forward in Education Scotland Outdoor Learning um, is a whole school in its community approach uh, to outdoor learning and to the development of outdoor learning and play and one of the key things in that that is this learning how to work in partnership with other people and kind of rehearsing those progressive cycles of working in partnership with people. So we've been absolutely delighted actually to work with Inspiring Scotland's Go To Play ventures in this, particularly with Smart Play Network who are leading uh, on this project for us. Um, because um, what we realise for our children and young people is that their learning and their play needs to be supported by a whole constellation of partners um, and the more that we um, work together actually to achieve these really important aims in transforming lives through learning for our children and young people, the better. So this is helping us be really good at that. I think ultimately we want to increase the confidence of the PSAs involved um, for them to go back to their schools and feel like they are leaders and knowledgeable about play um, and maybe to change some of their practice and to support them in what they're already doing and, and tell them what, what they are doing is good and that it does matter and that their role is valued. Um, and I think that ultimately if we can see that then we'll see individuals who are, who are striving to create better play experiences for children. I think for me it's making me think more. Um, you sort of just think the children will go and play whereas now we're actually thinking about the whole concept of play. Um, my, my school's really big, so we have a lot of pupils at our school, so there's not a lot of resources for them. So it'll be great to take back these ideas and show the other pupil support assistants some of the resources that we can use.